aka Arm Breeder Warrior here, and I'm coming at you with another video. And this video is going to be about iron sights, some nice budget friendly iron sights that I find on that I found on Amazon. And um, guess how much they cost? I'll give you a guess. It's extremely low for some iron sights. And you're probably thinking, like, uh, yo, how cheap could you get iron sights compared to the iron sights that I talked about in my last video, which were which were 16 bucks like how much more can you get i can tell you ten dollars and you're like bro those are probably some crappy ass sites not in my opinion now i got those iron sites because you know i want to get something nice and quick that i can put on my ar-15 until i can be able to save up so i can get some much more higher quality ones like you know the ones that are like what freaking 40 each ends up coming out to like 80 bucks but so far they have been holding up you know and uh i'm gonna show them i'm gonna show you the iron size right now okay guys in the chamber here and i take these on so these are the iron sights here here's the front one okay here is the rear iron side they are they're plastic, like they are, they are plastic, but they actually have been able to hold zero the whole time I've been um, I've been shooting. And uh, and here's my you know my red dot sight here. And when I would try when I would sight these, I sight these at 20 yards. You know, using my laser bore sight from my previous video on the part of view of that. And um, crazy thing is, when I sight it at 20 yards. I didn't need to adjust at all. I did not need to adjust this. Like, um, the only messed up part is it did not come with the tools to sight the front one. You know, of course, like there is a little bitty hole for an for an outlet key. You know, to uh to twist on down if you want to bring the front part up or down. But since I've bought um pair of iron sights before and I've uh you know the things and upgrades that you buy for your rifles or even for your uh your firearms they always come a lot of times it comes with outlet keys of different sizes so I tried I had about like what 10 of them and I tried I was like okay this one fits but crazy thing is like I said I didn't need to I was shooting accurately at 20 yards with the iron sights and I didn't need I didn't even need to adjust the front at all but on the back you see it has you can you know adjust the um the windage from left to right and it has and it has this little um you know you can flip the thing up for much precision shots and you can flip it down you can flip it down you know for much more closer closer range targets see so for the money, something that you want to put on just real quick until you get something better, better quality. There's nothing wrong with these at all. They've been able to hold zero. I have not had to recite these at all. And I just took this to the range um, with a friend of mine, Mac, uh, a couple of a couple of days ago, this past Saturday actually. And we put my 22 alarm conversion kit inside here, and we were hitting just fine. We were hitting from seven to ten to twenty yards, fifteen to twenty yards, just fine. So, and we were only shooting with the iron sights. We turned the red dot sight off and we were just shooting with straight iron sights. So, if you guys feel like $10, no, no, they're probably sketchy. That's why I'm making this review right now so you guys can feel comfortable about like buying these. Especially if you want to keep them permanently, that's your choice. But me, I do plan on upgrading, you know, sometime soon I, when I do happen to get some extra money. But for right now, these are holding pretty well. And um, so I'm definitely gonna leave the link in the description below so you guys can have the link to go purchase these if you like to. And this is the color that they come in. So if you guys like this video, please like, share, subscribe, and I really would appreciate it, guys. Have a good one. Stay safe, stay vigilant.